Ciao a tutti, siamo al Chinese Theater di Los Angeles per presentare il Los Angeles Film, Fashion and Art Festival. Get out of here! You're fired! And now, for our next video. You wrote the song of the year. Thank you. Can you smell the Oscars? Well, this is the building where the Oscars are going to be in a week, so I guess technically, yes, there's a smell of the, the Oscars in some way. But um, it's very, yeah, it's very exciting to be here. Um, we started this movie like six, yeah, about six years ago, and it is a very long road getting it made, actually making it, and then now to have people enjoying it this much is so gratifying because we, we, you never know when you're making a movie. When you're in the middle of making it, you never know how it's going to be received so to have people enjoying it like this is really fun I always call myself a granddaughter of Italy because you know I was not born there but my grandfather was and my father is very strongly identified with his roots he's a hundred percent Italian um, so I grew up with all of this older Italian culture all the songs and music and stories from my grandparents and my father and I try and go to Italy as much as possible and spend as much time as there as I can in fact my husband and I Chris Bacchus we got married in Capri. We decided to get married in Italy, even though he's not Italian, but we just love it so much and I felt that way it kind of honored my ancestry. Piacerebbe fare la colonna sonora di un film magari americano e di Kiss nel caso. Magari, magari. Ma sicuramente di Jim Carrey, perché io sono un grande fan di Jim Carrey, mi piace molto la sua um, la sua comicità e anche se sono napoletano e quindi Napoli ha una comicità a parte, amo molto la comicità di Jim Carrey, sono, sono super fan dei suoi film, da Truman Show, La settimana da Dio, The Mask, tutti i film. Come si chiamerebbe la tua canzone per il film di Jim Carrey? Cosso, cosso, cosso. Una domanda da, da fan, quando ti rivedremo in sella a un cavallo? Eh, forse già quest'anno, se tutto va bene dovrei fare due western, non, non uno, due. Speriamo. Puoi dirci qualcosa di più? Beh, uno dovrebbe essere l'ultimo Django, e eh, uno che ho, ma che ho, ma Rises, sono due film che ho fatto anni fa e vogliono fare, non dico il remake, ma e tutte e due, in tutte e due l'eroe è un po' invecchiato, diciamo. Tonight you're very lucky to be here at Chinese Theatre because Mr. Sylvester Stallone is going to honor Mel Gibson, director of the year! But there's something unique about him. It just radiates off of him. He's gifted. So it's my privilege, great honor, and I give you total respect for my longtime friend, the director of the year, Mel Gibson. Uh, in a very simple way, to express my gratitude to you and all the people of Italy, very simple phrase, that he said, when I say it, you will know in your hearts what it means. And it is, non mi avete addosso la salsa di bombole. I can only say again, again, I love you, thank you for this, uh, for this, uh, for this, whatever it is, award. I'm more than happy to accept it. And uh, I'll, I'll take all your good energy.